Hey guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Simply Christelle. Today's video, I am going to be sharing with you guys my Sephora VIB haul. It's very pathetic because I didn't get a lot of stuff, but I just wanted to share with you guys the little bit of stuff that I got from this VIB sale. So if you want to see my VIB sale products that I got, then just keep watching. So when I say it's pathetic, I only have five products in front of me and then I have two other products that are coming in the mail but Sephora decided to be very, they're really backed up right now, their warehouse, so th those products I'm not getting until like later on and this video is already going on super late. But anyways, let me just get started with you guys and to share with you what I got. So the first item is, the two of, two of these items are actually restocks. So I'll just go over the first one. The first one is my Peter Thomas Roth Water Drench Broad Spectrum SPF 45 Hyaluronic Cloud Moisturizer. I love, 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 love this moisturizer. I used to use the jar one, but I figured why not get the one that has the sunscreen in it. So this is the same formula as the jar, but this one has sunscreen in it. So I it it's two in one. So I really love this. This really hydrates my skin. This is amazing and it is the best. So yes, I love this um, for my skin. It just helps my skin look plump and I feel like it's the reason why my foundation looks so dewy all the time is because I use this um, moisturizer because it has hyaluronic acid and it's very... I just love it as a daytime moisturizer. I've talked about this moisturizer so much many times on my channel, but I really, really love this moisturizer a lot. It, it is amazing. It is pricey. I believe it's $52, which is pretty pricey, but it's worth it for me because it has the moisturizer in it and it's a, and it's a sunscreen. And I also, these last me like two months. So I buy like one of these every two months, which is not too bad, you know? So I really love this. And another restock that I got is the Belief, Belief, Belief True Cream Moisturizing Balm. I love this for nighttime. I was trying to maybe try, like test out other moisturizers for my nighttime routine, but for whatever reason, I keep going back to this one. This is the only one that I feel like it works for me. The only one that I feel works for my skin it gives me the enough moisture at nighttime I feel like I like to do heavier moisture at night because I'm going to sleep so I really want to hydrate my skin overnight and I feel like this is the only moisturizer that I've used that really gives me that I've tried um I tried the fresh lotus nighttime moisturizer I've tried old Henriksen I've tried so many nighttime moisturizer but I keep going back to this one so I just restocked on it and this retails for $38 and it is so amazing like it's it's a white cream let me show you guys it is a white cream moisturizer and it feels super like it looks lightweight but it is heavier they do have a gel one um the aqua bomb gel that one is really 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 nice as well it's just a little too light for me like in a sense of it i feel like it doesn't hydrate as much as i want it to be hydrated at nighttime that's why i go for the cream for the night but if i wasn't using this um the aqua bomb one the gel moisturizer is amazing i would use that one for something new that i got that's all i got for skincare and for something new that i got i got this cute little thing from rare beauty oh my god the packaging of the blush is so freaking cute i love it so this is the rare beauty um cream blush i did use it i used it on my face today to do my makeup um today before filming this video and i got the shade nearly apricot and I know it doesn't show much on my skin, but in person you can really see it here. Let me dab some more on my skin to show you guys what it looks like. This is just such a beautiful like blush. I'm just dabbing a little bit on my cheeks just to show you guys. I love this blush. I think it is so nice. It's very natural looking. Um, let me just zoom you guys in. You see, it's very, it's super natural looking. I feel like it's 
looks like it's coming from within my skin like it's not super heavy and it has like this glow to it so i really really like this blush and i just love the packaging and inside you get a little mirror so i feel like when i'm applying you know the blush i just use my little mirror and apply the blush on my cheeks now the only thing i will say of this blush is that it because it is so lightweight you kind of do have to use a lot because it's very light um i don't know if it's my lighting but i feel like you can't really see it that much but actually you can you can see it you can see the blush like right here but i've been loving cream blushes a lot i really use only cream cream brushes now cream or liquid blushes i don't really go for my powder brushes blushes anymore um i don't know just because i i, I love the way cream blushes look like they're coming from within i love the look of cream blushes now this shade is like a apricot um peachy shade and this is what it looks like on my skin and the reason why i got this shade is because i felt like peachy colors look really good on darker skin now the other thing i will say is that it is a little bit lighter like apricot because see in my sephora i went to sephora inside jc penny and everything just looks more intense inside there so it looked more pigmented than what it's looking now like it looked darker than this in the store but i really still like it um i just think you know maybe i will have to use this with another blush but i love this formula of the rare beauty and i love the packaging it is so adorable and i would love to purchase more of these blushes i think these retail for 21 dollars if i'm not mistaken i think so and the last two things i picked up are lip products i got the sephora con um contour gel lip liner and i got it in the shade nothing but nude again in the store it looked more brown it looked it had like more of a brownish tint to it looks kind of coolish pinkish but in the store it had more of like a brown undertone that's why i picked it up and then i also got this lipstick by kat von d this is the um not having the kvd beauty and this is the uh, bow and arrow liquid lipstick i got a mini one i've always wanted to try bow and arrow because it, it looks like such a beautiful like cool tone brown shade so i've always wanted to try this shade and i would love to do like a full cool toned look using this lipstick shade and then the things that i ordered were the estee lauder night serum i love that freaking thing i got the kit i got the night i'll insert a picture i got the night serum it came from moisturizer and eye cream i am so excited to get my package on that because i love the night serum i use it all the time it is so expensive it hurt me to spend that type of money but i knew i had to do it because it's part of like my holy grails for my skincare i love it and then i also got the um new sticks brow gel the gel xl i love the new sticks brow gel i love how it makes my eyebrows very crunchy and so i never use because i always bought the the gel and the eyebrow pencil together but now they sell the gel on its own so i just bought the gel on its own and so i'm excited for those packages to come in and that's my Sephora haul that I got. I know it's not an extreme extravagant haul. It's just that I've been trying to save more money. You know, and I've been trying to just spend my money more wisely. I hope you guys like this video. I know it wasn't much. It was very little. And it's not like, you know. But thank you so much for watching. I appreciate every time you guys watch my videos. Every time you leave a comment. It just like... it it motivates me to create more videos so i just want to say thank you thank you so so much and please 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 subscribe if you're not already and i'll see you guys in the next video bye